Hello, my name is Joel Lababa, and I'm the Franchise King. You're going to need a minimum net worth of $300,000 in order for you to be able to even consider becoming the owner of a franchise, buying a startup franchise, all right? $300,000 minimum. Now, I'm not talking about $300,000 in cash. I'm talking about your net worth because a $300,000 net worth is not a lot. Uh, it's, it's barely enough to be qualified for most franchise opportunities. For example, if you have a $300,000 net worth, now your, your net worth is obviously, well, maybe it's not so obvious. Let me tell you what your net worth is based on. It is assets minus liabilities. For instance, your home is a real estate asset. Let's, let's say it's worth $200,000, but you owe $80,000 on it. So in the asset column, you put $200,000. In the liability column, you put $80,000, all right? So first add up all your assets, then add up all your liabilities, and then the difference between the two is your net worth. So when you think about it, a $300,000 net worth is not that much. Most franchisors, you're, you're really gonna be kind of under the minimum, but I'm using the $300,000 amount because I'm going to say that you don't have to buy a retail franchise or a restaurant franchise in order to be successful and in order to buy a franchise. So you can, for instance, you can get like a consulting franchise, a business coaching franchise for under $100,000. In that case, if you have a $300,000 or so net worth, you know, you, you, you should be in pretty good shape. But if you're looking at a, let's say a food franchise that has a total investment between five and $600,000, you know, you're going to have to pretty much come up with $100,000 of your own money. And if you only have a $300,000 net worth, $100,000 is not going to leave you with much. All right. Now, I have, I have a way for you to, to put this in, in a better perspective. Kind of, um, you know, I'm throwing numbers out and, and it might be a little confusing. So until you do your own net worth statement, you're not going to really understand what, I, what I'm trying to get to. So what I've done, a friend of mine, Jeff, has, has coded in a really nice free net worth calculator on my website. If you go to thefranchiseking.com forward slash blog and look down about halfway, you're going to see a picture of a calculator. Kind of. Kind of like that. And all you have to do is click it. And, and you'll be able to figure out what your net worth is really quickly, really fast. Now, it might take you an hour or so or a couple hours to get together everything that you need for, you know, for your computations. You know, you might have to go to your bank statements and your stock statements, et cetera, to figure out everything. But once you have it, it'll take you like maybe 10 minutes to do a net worth calculation. So go to thefranchiseking.com forward slash blog. Go to the right-hand side. The sidebar, you will see a picture of a cool calculator. Click it and take 5-10 minutes to do your net worth calculation. That way, you'll know where you are at exactly. Because, you know, there's that saying, if you don't know where you're at, how are you going to end up going where you're going? Something like that. Maybe it's, if you don't know where you're at, how are you going to be able to figure out where you're going? Yeah, I think that's it. Anyway, use the free tool that Jeff created for you on thefranchiseking.com and, uh, let me know how it comes out. I am the Franchise King, Joel Lababa.